Most people who know me as an organized writer know that when I'm encouraging people to script their interviews, that I'm encouraging them to also organize them in a timeline that makes most sense to the logical, predictive answers that are likely to come in the interview. And openly, we get lots of good quality surprises sometimes with that, but I always feel that any talk show, any radio host, any public television broadcast host should always be willing to write some of the questions, if not all of the questions, in advance to the person they're going to interview. That would totally keep us from having to suffer through all the like and other verbal pauses that people often say when they're doing things to serve you. It also keeps them much more focused and much more capable of answering so that we don't get sound bites that plague and destroy our uh, video tracks and audio tracks across the land with bullshit stories. Not every human being is good in the impromptu. Most of the politicians are great orators and great speakers, but they're not always uh, good people at the impromptu conversations they think they ought to be. And openly, that's the truth. Now, in life, we have moments of time to speak the truth about who we are and what we do. And as we do these things, we have to understand what is important to you may not be important to me. But so much of my time gets wasted on YouTube when I have to watch news studies that are not credible. That someone makes an off-the-cuff comment of, being, of just merely being human and dealing with a difficult question, and openly then they're obliterated by it in the news. We have to get back to the reality of generalities, that in general this person thinks this. In general this person does this. Not today, on a fluke day, this person did this. Now someone could say that perhaps about my audio channel, and that goes back to my own humanity and humility of saying, hey, you don't like listening to me? That's okay, but maybe you didn't listen to the right video, and you didn't write, listen to the right audio cast because you didn't let God lead you. You see, what you should be doing when you're searching online is being led by the Holy Ghost to saying, that's a good article, that is not. That's for you, that is not. And openly, even in reading, how far you need to read, the Holy Ghost can tell you because what do we know about God? God knows every human being, everything they've done, everything they've written, everything that's out there because why? It's the Holy Ghost that is helping them to live their life.